it's been a really long time since I played Hearthstone. You got back into it. Yeah. Last time I played Hearthstone, there was like, I think it's Paladin? It was like a, there's like a Murloc Paladin thing or a Murloc Priest thing. I forget. But there were a lot of Murlocs and I like Murlocs. So I was like, oh, 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 oh. they're really shitty though. Anyways, back when I played Hearthstone, Illidan wasn't a thing. But now he is a thing. So. About goddamn time. He's been in the fucking series for God knows how long. I know. So we're going to play through the Illidan story. I'm really bad at this. Hi, Liam. So here's here's the situation. Eden is playing this. I'm not. Um, Eden knows about a lot of Warcraft lore. I really enjoy Warcraft lore. Also, I'm eating candy, so if I'm like, that's but, fine. But Eden doesn't play Warcraft games. No, I just fucking love the lore. I played Warcraft 3. I never played World of Warcraft. So that's my kind of background with this. So I know some of the older, more famous characters in the series. Anything past Warcraft 3, I have no fucking idea. So, this whole story is probably going to be new to me. <laughs> See, I don't even know what this is, but I'm assuming this is Outworld stuff. Um, one of the major things that happened in Warcraft 3, Frozen Throne specifically, is that the human campaign is kind of more like the outcasts. Mm -hmm. um, the Blood Elves. You start as the Blood Elves. And then you kind of start to ally yourself with the Naga and Illidan's forces. And you become this amalgamation in the Outworld to take over Outworld. Mm -hmm. So that's how I know Illidan. Because Illidan becomes a major character at the end of Frozen Throne. That you play as him towards the end. You get a brief stint in the Reign of Chaos that you get to play as him during the Night Elves campaign, but he kind of gets screwed over by uh, by uh, his own forces. I can just throw out like Warcraft 3 facts <laughs> if you want. That'll be well, my... Do it! Um, do it, because I'm enjoying playing the game. The only other thing that I know, um, it, and then Eden had told me this and I was recognizing it before, uh, a lot of notable voice actors are in this game. Yeah, uh, this makes Carter really hard. I mean, that's just the fact that you got, like, main characters like Jaina Proudmoore's voiced by Laura Bailey. Mm -hmm. um, Illidan is voiced, voiced by, by Liam O'Brien. Rexar is voiced by Matt Mercer. Oh, that's uh, fun. Yeah, so the hunter. One, um, of the, uh, one of the story modes I was playing, the one where it's like, let's fight the Legion of Evil, that guy was Travis Willingham. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Um... Rexar is another interesting one because mm -hmm. Frozen Throne doesn't have an orc campaign. Mm -hmm. The orcs campaign in Frozen Throne is the creation of the Horde in Durgar. So you play as Rexar, and it's the closest thing you'll get to playing World of Warcraft in Warcraft 3. Because you just control Rexar and his bear, and you just go around to all the main areas of Durgar and help the Horde become the Horde, while Thrall is still in charge. That's before Thrall kind of, like, steps off, and then you get Garrosh Hellscream. Um, who I have no, no fucking idea who that is, because I didn't play World of Warcraft, so... Yeah. Little useless tidbits, tidbits of Warcraft 3 lore <laughs> that, you'll, that you'll learn from this. I used to play the Pokemon TCG competitively, but it's so different than this. Yeah, this is a lot more flashy, but... Um, mm. This is also, like... Is it a lot more simplified? I wouldn't say simplified. Um, sorry, it's my turn. Yeah, I don't really know anything about, about this. So wait, what? what's your character that you're playing? Uh, I don't know who this is. I don't know who this is either. But, like, you know what her class is? Because I know there's a class system in this game. Oh, I don't know what fucking class this is either. I've never played this story mode before. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, so I used to play the Pokemon TCG. I used to play it competitively in person. Um, there is also a, uh... Oh, nice. There is also, like, a web game, which I love playing, which yeah. plays slightly different. It's a little more Hearthstone-y, but, um, yeah. 
I feel like Hearthstone started off this, like, TCG mm. madness. Like, there's mm. a whole bunch of other series that wanted to get in on the... On the oh, the Pokemon one's been out for a long time. But I feel like once Hearthstone dropped, then you had things like Gwent come out. I have no clue what that is. Gwent is the Witcher's version of this. Oh, okay. Yeah. Toss a coin to your witcher. Yeah. Oh, valley of plenty. Oh, valley of plenty. So, we watched The Witcher recently. I like the guy who's like donkey. The bard. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, we watched The Witcher, and like halfway through, especially whenever the bard's on screen, <laughs> he's like, This is just Shrek. It is just Shrek. <laughs> it's just a hornier version of Shrek. Like, oh no. Cursed magic woman and guy who's discriminated against her in love, and then there's like this random fucking horny singing guy. I'm alone. There's no one here besides me. Stop it, babe. We're gonna get demonetized. My problems have all we're, gone. We're gonna, we're gonna stop it. Stop it. She's just screaming in the background. Stop. Stop it. Did she say ghost in the shell? I have no fucking clue. Sorry, I, I didn't hear. Uh, this battle is long. I should have started a timer. Fucking hell, I keep forgetting to start a timer. <laughs> Whatever, why don't we go through like, if we can, let's see if we can go through like, three. Three battles? Actually, you know what? No, let's see if you can just get through this story. So, um, it looks like you're doing good. Still I have no idea who this woman is that you're playing as, but she's a night elf, that's all I mm. can say. Maybe someone who's trying to hunt Illidan? Because that's absolutely a possibility with yeah. the way that Illidan left the Night Elves. Mm -hmm. I don't know, there was story stuff, but we were talking over it. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. I just like talking about Warcraft 3 story because it's actually really good. Fun fact, in the Frozen Throne, uh, mm -hmm. there is a Night Elf who's hunting Illidan the entire time, mm -hmm. who they call the Warden, and I don't remember her actual name. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um... She's a bitch, but she's hunting Illidan the, the whole time. Like, she goes to the outworld and tries to chase after him. I don't remember if she dies I doing win. that, but this might be a completely different person. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of things that are, like, just for her stone, so... What did he say? The Rusted Legion? Rusted Legion. I think that might be the name of Illidan's group. Mm -hmm. Um, what's her name? Glaive. Glaive bound and dead. Oh, I have no idea what yeah, that is. I don't know either. Um, mm -hmm. well, I, what I did know is that guy, that guy that you were just facing, he's a Drenai. Mm -hmm. Drenor? Drenai? I forgot how you say it. They grew up in the, uh, in the, uh, outworld. Mm -hmm. And they were kind of being, um... Overwhelmed and spent. What is that? So Arana is the name of the person. Yeah, I, I think that's someone's just made for this story. Um, yeah. I, is that a fucking Beholder? I've never seen Beholders in Warcraft before. I have no clue. Arana Starseeker. Yeah, this seems like someone who was made specifically for this. It's a Naga. Oh, it's a... Oh, it's a Naga. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you're going to see a, a mix of a number of different races in this mode. Mm -hmm. Start with the Draenei, then there's a the Naga. You're probably going to come across uh, Kael'thas, mm -hmm. who is like the main blood elf. Mm -hmm. um, Illidan's probably the final one. Wiccans after four demons die. Huh? What? I don't get this until four demons die. Four demons? Yeah. So like... See, this card says minion at the bottom? Yeah. It's not a demon. That's a spell card. That's a minion. Demons on spell. your side? Not I think it's just four demons in general. Huh. You got bamboozled. Bamboozled again. I like Donkey from Shrek. I am Donkey from Shrek. You are now. I am. What I do remember mm -hmm. from Warcraft 3, though, mm -hmm. is that that final mission... Because the takeover of the Outworld is the final mission, essentially. Mm -hmm. Let's say you go down the Orc campaign, which isn't really a, a campaign. Um, 
It's the hardest mission in the game, mm -hmm. obviously. But, like... No, no. Wait a minute. No, it's not the final mission in the game. Undead's campaign is the final mission. Let's call the Frozen Throne. I'm fucking stupid. Uh, oh, Illidan actually uh, gets assigned a mission. Mm -hmm. Not from Arkham. Who the fuck was the one? He gets uh, sent over to um, to re basically retrieve the Frozen Throne or sit atop the mm -hmm. Frozen Throne. No, he has to go and destroy it. He has to destroy the Frozen Throne. But Arthas, who at this point is fully like taken over by the Frostmourne, mm -hmm. uh, he's essentially the one who has to go and sit in the Frozen Throne or else he's going to die. So him and his undead army fight Illidan's Rusted Legion. I'm assuming this is Illidan's uh, group. Mm -hmm. They fight each other in like the peak of the world. I bet you anything. Someone who knows the Warcraft 3 story is going to be like, you're missing so many important details of this. I haven't played Warcraft 3 in a long time, especially since Reforge came out. Because... Reforge fucked everything up. So tell, tell me about that, because like, I really don't know anything about that. So Reforge, um, it's kind of... It was a situation where um, they kind of just took the same game and made it worse. Mm -hmm. Um, they updated the graphics slightly, mm -hmm. but they had promised that, like, the story mode was going to have, like, cool, um, new cutscenes, um, which they, they promised in promotional material, and then they cut them in the final game. Mm -hmm. Um, there's another thing where it's like, and this was to be expected because, um, Warcraft 3's online mode, like, it's, like, mm -hmm. online creator um that was what essentially made dota mm -hmm. and what made league of legends they made it first yeah but uh blizzard put in something that said everything that you make in that's right. three belongs to us now i remember yeah and everyone was like what the fuck like how are we supposed to like mm -hmm. <laughs> it, was, it was compared to like what people were able to get away with back in the original game yeah. And, like, when I played online, there was one game I played. I didn't play the Dota uh, one that people made. Mm -hmm. There was literally a game mode, uh, which was Manhunt, mm -hmm. where there was, like, 12 sheep that could make things on the map and mm -hmm. three wolves. And the wolves had to hunt all the sheep. And it was actually a really... I forget what the actual game was called, but... Mm -hmm. It was really fun. <laughs> that sounds cool. Yeah. So what the hell's going on? Are you winning? No. No? How do you, wait, how can you tell? I'm running really fucking bad. Oh my god. You just got hit for ten. How about this? We'll finish this up if you lose any of these battles three times. Okay. So this is going to be a long recording. Mm -hmm. So if you lose three times throughout the entirety of the story, it's done. Okay. Just bang. Now you're trying to focus. Mm. Oh no, it's my turn, so I'm trying to focus. My god, how do you kill that thing? Well, I just did. Oh. Sorry, I was looking at the 10 that I had. Oh, fuck yeah, I got it! What? Oh, it's got Wind Fury? So, Wind Fury can attack twice. Rush can attack minions immediately, because normally when you play a card, you have to wait a turn. Outcast. An outcast. A bonus if played as the left or right most card in the hand. So she is actually a Naga. Mm -hmm. So she's a Naga that's helping you? I guess. I guess that's... Because she's an outcast, but, like... Mm -hmm. I'm not sure how this works. I don't know, like, what the story is with this, so... Uh -oh. I play cards. I'm, I'm trying to figure out the story, because that's, that's what I'm... Mm -hmm. That's what I'm doing. You got a secret. It's a secret. Was Deal that two damage to all enemies. Ah. But you killed like three people. Mm-hmm. What's your thing? Like your your character's personal ability. The right tool, hero power, discover a card from your deck. It's me it means I don't draw a card, it just like happens to appear, so say I discover a card, I still have fourteen cards in my deck. Oh. Mm -hmm. You're probably a hunter. 
That's hunter or ranger, because I know those two are, are, you know, specific things. Looks like you're doing okay. I'm not doing as well as I would have hoped. If I can get this in one go, I'd be really impressed with myself. Oh my god, that is a lot of enemies. Mm-hmm. But wait, are nope, any of them... I wouldn't. Yeah, I was gonna say, are, are any of them blocking? Nope! Yeah! There's no... There's None of them are taunting, so... Oh god, are they... Are they talking in rhyme? Is this whole story in rhyme? I don't know. I hope not. So whatever class I am, I'm only level 3 in? That's what I'm thinking. Like, it, you're either... Like, you're a new class. Or you're a uh, class that you just don't play. Which is most of them. <laughs> What's the next chapter? In mushroom jungle, chaos Oh my god, Wait, this is, is this, in rhyme! Is this literally just fucking Wizard of Oz? It might be. Because <laughs> I know Hearthstone has a lot more, like, comedic mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. things that they do compared that to the That wasn't a fart. The chair rubbed up against something. Oh, yeah. My recording room is, like... Or, like, my office is very small. Mm -hmm. And, uh... At least you have an office. Yeah, that's true. Roar in quotations, mm -hmm. <laughs> but yeah, mm -hmm. the 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 computer chair that we have it kind of like rubs. Godzilla. What? Godzilla. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it rubs up against the wall, and mm -hmm. you know it's it all just makes noise. Natural leader, gather your outcasts and prepare for battle. Oh, so you're just like a whole bunch of people. Small creature hides among them. Is that another Naga? Spirit of the Raptor. Well, that thing is just attacking. Yeah, your hero's gonna attack. Let me discover a card. Discover a card. Pharaoh Cat. This thing has a lot of HP. Yeah. So it's just gonna start eating people? Mm hmm. It's like ravenous omnivore. It's eating my mushrooms. Lifesteal. See, I don't know, I don't remember any of these abilities, so... Mm hmm Oh, it's okay. But I can talk about more Warcraft 3 facts. Do it. <laughs> so, we uh, tried recording a bit of this before we started this actual recording, and uh, Eden did a Jaina's story mode, I believe? Yeah. Um, the mission against Archimod. Mm -hmm. So, I can talk about that one. That's actually the final mission in the original Reign of Chaos. Warcraft 3 game. So that one is kind of like you have 20 minutes to set up your defenses and wait for Archimon to just send waves and waves of enemies at you. Um, you have Janus human forces in front, um, Thrall's orc forces in the middle, and then your night elf forces are at the back. You're controlling Scenarius and um, oh god, I forget her name. She's on a tiger. Uh, Tyrion? Tyron? Tyronda? I think it's Tyronda. Um, I don't know. I'm focused on fucking Hearthstone right now. But you're protecting the world tree. Um, and by, by like the end of the 20 minutes... No, it's an hour. You have to actually protect yourself for an hour. My fucking god. It's a long mission because it's the final mission. Mm -hmm. um, so you're pre protecting yourself for an hour and then... Um, Cenarius essentially like bugs the world tree with wisps so that Archimon just kind of decides like fuck it I'm gonna go in there and take it out myself so he goes up and then all the wisps come out and just destroy him so Warcraft 3 story imagine you're like your mom calls you for dinner while oh you're in the middle God. of that I think like I've, I've had that happen like you can pause the game obviously okay but, like, my god. One of the things that I love to do... Wait, was I supposed to be protecting him? Protecting who? Oh, no, I'm still alive. <laughs> so, one of the things that uh, I'd love to do is... Mm -hmm. The story mode can be fucking hard. 
-hmm. And sometimes um, I just decide, like, I want to play it and I'll just use cheats. And I just want to check around the map mm -hmm. and, like, not focus on the main mission. So one of the things that you can do uh, on that final mission is there's a whole bunch of villages in the area. And when you go there with, um, with scenarios, um, mm -hmm. you actually get a whole bunch of new units on your side from that area. Mm -hmm. So you can get like bugbears, you can get uh, trolls, you can get a whole bunch of enemies you can just uh, send up and then sit with Jaina mm -hmm. and just block from Archimond who's going to be just sending in more more enemies, more reinforcements. Mm -hmm. So um, there's a lot to that final chapter. Yeah. Um, and yeah. Warcraft 3. I actually still have a copy of the original Warcraft 3. Mm -hmm, the untainted, untouched. Untainted, untouched by by Reforged mm -hmm. on my old laptop. Yeah, because wasn't it like if you had the old copy and you bought Reforged, you tainted it? It gets updated with the new rules that Reforged added. Mm. Even if you went for the old school one. Mm -hmm. I have not touched that old laptop. Mm -hmm. uh, it still has Warcraft 3 on it. So, I have, like, one of the few copies of Warcraft 3 that has been unsullied by Reforged. Mm -hmm. So, I'm... That's that's why I keep that pe that that laptop, to be honest. Mm -hmm. I can't fucking attack him? Do you have to attack the minions first? Sometimes it forces you to. Hmm. And I don't know why. Doesn't even matter how hard you try. Wait, there's raptors in the outworld? <laughs> That's not something I've seen. You have to attack those minions. Oh, that's damn. so weird. Wing blast! Well, she's dead. She's dead, but I've got Godzilla. Sorry, Godzilla. Oh my gosh. So, whenever this minion takes damage, double its attack. Well, that's why nobody's attacking it right now. Yeah, nobody's attacking it. Mm -hmm. Bambazel. Micro Mummy. Micro Mummy. I didn't know a I didn't know a was in this game. Can someone please attack Godzilla? Nobody's gonna attack Godzilla. I think they're gonna kill you. Yeah. You're dead. Yeah. Oh well. Oh gosh. That's no, okay. First death. It's a pee break. That's a pee break. That's a pee break, which is gonna be edited out, correct? Oh yeah. Do you want me to get you back to the I'm not gonna play the mission, I'm just gonna Hey guys, welcome to Welcome to Carter's Corner. Yeah. Check in. Uh, oh my god, there's so many fucking chapters to this. Let's be a demon hunter. How many fucking chapters? Oh my god, there's five chapters. Um, wow, okay. I didn't think this was gonna be, uh, there's gonna be this much. There. I don't care what anyone else likes. Ogres are not like cakes. Parfaits are the most delicious thing on the whole damn planet. Go. I was just thinking about Shrek while I was peeing. Of course you're thinking about Shrek while you're peeing. <laughs> I'm sitting on a hand. Yes, you are. Literally, I'm sitting on, like, the chair that, that we have in this room is a giant hand. Like in Arrested Development. I got it from my dad. Yes, you did. Yeah. So I just checked. Yeah. There's five chapters. Yeah. Five separate book pages. Yeah. I thought it was like all the chapters were on that one map. <laughs> I checked the book and I was like, oh god. Yeah, no, there's there's a lot. There is a lot. Did you skib. find out who that small creature was? I still I think don't it's know. Skib. Gib? Skib. But you have it on your side, don't you? Yeah, I don't know. I don't fucking know, I just play the game. And knuckles and knuckles and knuckles. Knuckles and fuckles. <laughs> Nipples the enchilada. Nipples and tipples and tipples. If my if the position of my cursor bugs you, too fucking bad. Is there seriously people who Well cause I, I like I like I do this. We're playing on on computer. Mm -hmm. On the computer, hence why there is a cursor to begin with. Yes. We do, in fact, have a computer. Yeah, it is my computer. Mm -hmm. My really crappy MacBook. <laughs> That's okay. I have a crappy, like, 10-year-old PC. Oh, yeah. 
Mm-hmm. That's sitting under my old piece, my old laptop. Mm-hmm. We have to get a new computer. Yeah, we're gonna build a computer, remember? Yeah, I know. I'm just, I'm just saying. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I can't wait for us to get a new computer. Do you want to build that fucking card capture soccer computer that I showed you yesterday? <sighs> it looks so good. Carter likes one particular Maho Shoujo. Car Captors is the one that I grew up with. Yeah. I grew up with a whole bunch. Yeah. Yeah. Maho Shoujo is a great genre. <laughs> it's actually a great genre. Well, like, it was also animated fucking beautifully. It was. Yeah. I will admit that. That first episode, first scene of her in front of the Eiffel Tower, which is not actually the Eiffel Tower, I forget what the tower was. It's in Japan. Um, it's the red one. I believe in you. You can do this. You can beat this thing. Do you believe in me? Yeah. Oh yeah, when I take damage, deal that much damage to the enemy. Oh, mm-hmm. are you holding that for a... Uh... It's a secret. So I've got two things with uh, taunt right now, so the enemy can't attack me directly. Oh, mm. true, true, true. <gasps> Fuck! It's fucking lynxes. You have to summon all of them? <laughs> well, I'm gonna summon all of them. Oh shit, he had a secret? I mean, you still killed something, so. Mm, do this one to get rid of it. Snake! A la boom boom! A la boom boom. Job's done. Job's done. You wanna keep talking about Warcraft? Uh, you seem to be having fun with that. I'm trying to, like, what's, what's something you wanna know? I don't know, just tell me whatever. Uh, alright, uh, there's four main races, so ask me about either human, orc, undead, or night elf. Undead. Undead. Okay. Um, well, undead is actually really interesting. Every, in Warcraft 3, Mm -hmm. every race has their own, this is just gonna become, like, here's how you play as each race. (laughs) <laughs> um, so Fuck yeah, I do it. Gives me more time to play uh, Hearthstone. So, human and orc are very, very similar. Um, there's two main resources. There's the gold mine, which gives you gold, and then there's trees, so you cut down trees for lumber. Those are your two main resources to make anything in that game. Um, sad death. <laughs> but, um... Just kill your friend? There's my secret. Oh, well, you just killed him. I just won the game. Are you all right? Sporlock. I don't know what you said. But you should come with us. It isn't safe here. So, um, yeah, so you got gold and lumber. And every, um, humans and orcs interact with both of those the same. Mm-hmm. They kind of run, like, they'll run through the gold mine, just grab gold for your main town hall. Ready for uh, some more story stuff? Oh. Balthorok. A peaceful Maghar orc is besieged by this rusted monstrosity. Does he have a chainsaw? He does have a fucking chainsaw. Oh my His god. Power. After the, a demon dies, draw a card and restore ten health to your hero. <sighs> oh boy. Oh, this is gonna be tough. But, um... The only the two races that don't deal with some of these the same way mm-hmm. is undead and night elf. Mm-hmm. So undead and night elf, when dealing with their gold mine, they have to actually construct a facility over top of the gold mine to be able to extract stuff out of it. Um, night elves have to have trees all around them um, in order to be able to get lumber. Mm-hmm. So they actually don't have to cut down trees. You can just put a wisp on a tree and it'll like infinitely source lumber from it. God, you're a fucking nerd. But <laughs> undead undead have their own fucking thing where you actually can't build undead uh, buildings on anything except tainted land. You can't build um, anything until you corrupt a gold mine. And the gold mine, once it's corrupted, it spawns tainted land around it, and that's when you can start building your undead area. They're the only class that has that limitation. The only race that has that limitation. Damn. So, which kind of sucks for them, but it makes them e- it makes them harder to play. Mm-hmm. But they've got some cool shit in them. I don't really play uh, undead. I play orc. 
I'm an orc bro. Yeah, you love orcs. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Would you fuck an orc? No. <laughs> well, they're not real. Raptor hatchling. I didn't realize the dinosaurs spawned here. Mm-hmm. Thank you for the kiss. You're welcome. I can be nice sometimes. <laughs> Oh, Will I regret wrath. this? Oh, the wrath guards. So they said there's an orc that's been... Like something's going on with them? But you got a wolf! You got a wolf on your side. A wolf among us. <laughs> that's a game we need to play. A game you need to play. I played it a bunch of times. Yeah. Yeah. It's based off the Fables comics, which is one of my favorite series. Among Us? No, The Wolf Among Us. Oh, Wolf Among Us. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you just said, like, the game Among Us. Yeah, no. Wolf Among Us. Yeah. Yeah. Did he just attack himself again? No, that's Lifesteal. Oh. So he attacked himself, yes, because that was one of my secrets. But, uh, he has Lifesteal, so he got his, uh, his health back. Ah, uh, I see. Despicable Dreadlord. Get all the lynxes out of here. You have so many lynxes! Mm -hmm. Pitlord has uh, one of the coolest cutscenes in Warcraft 3. Mm -hmm. During uh, Reign of Chaos' orc campaign, uh, well, every campaign has their own like cool CG cutscene, but mm -hmm. uh, orcs is cool because it's Thrall and Grom Hellscream mm -hmm. uh, essentially fighting a Pitlord underground. Mm -hmm. um, it, it looks cool. You're cool. You're cool. No, I don't! <laughs> As you kill them all. You are literally running through all of them. Oh, shit. I'm just gonna kill all of the- all the lynxes. God, that pit lord is... Vulgar homunculus. Fuck you too. Oh my god, you've got a lot of enemies. Mm-hmm. Well, hold on a second. What was that last one? Uh, destroy your opponents left and right most minions. What are you? What are you gonna do? What you gonna? Uh, oh, excuse Bless. me. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? We all die. You either kill yourself or get killed. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? I don't notice I'm not very good at this game. Uh, he's also healing himself after like everything. Yeah, I know. So. That's that. That's why I'm trying to get rid of all the minions, is so he can't heal. Oh my god! It seems like you're fighting an uphill battle. Yeah. How about this? If if you lose this one, then we're we'll we'll stop the. I want to try one more time. Wait, she can attack twice. Yeah, she has one fury. God damn. I feel like I had mentioned that before. I can't remember. Fury thing. Yeah, I don't know. Well, um, this guy is just attacking himself with his own creatures. But then he's healing. Yeah. Because they have life steal. God damn. This guy is annoying. Yeah, this is fucking hard. And this is only the first page. Mm hmm. There's five pages. My god. Oh, so if they have the shield around them, they have to attack him first? Yeah. It's froggy. There's three of them. Whoa, what? Oh, that's the orc. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's only two cards left in his deck. That's awesome. Well, oh, he's going to start taking damage. Yep. I know that much. Mm -hmm. If he starts taking damage, then... Oh, I think the the idea is you just have to hold out. Yeah, that for as might long be as it. possible. Because his whole strategy seems to be just, like, throwing out minions. But if he has no minions left, mm -hmm. he's just going to start losing HP. Yeah. There we go. Now he's just taking damage. Oh, God. Oh, you get No, <laughs> you I get, get the, the life, life steal? steal. Oh, my God. You just have to hold out at this point. Mm-hmm. He keeps drawing cards. 
Yeah, I think that's the whole... I think you're right, you just have to hold out. So I'm gonna play this Murloc. Are the Murlocs good at, like, holding... No, this one you draw three cards. Oh, you, you get them to draw cards? Yeah. Oh, wow. There well, I win. all right. Well, that's. I feel like that's as good a place as any to stop for this one. You beat the first page. I did beat the first page. You got a victory. Uh. So, uh, last. Uh, oh. So the last thing I'll tell you before we quit. Do you want to know why that orc is red? Why is that orc red? figure out in the next part of uh, this Hearthstone Let's Play if you want to keep going. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll let you know on the, next, on the next part of this Let's Play. That's it. See you guys. Bye.